Hello everyone, my name is Yedot555 and welcome back to my blind let's play of SMB0. Uh, in the previous part I reached uh, the halfway point of World 03 and also got done with World 02, thankfully. Uh, so uh, I'm continuing this, rec uh, this uh, recording session uh, from the previous part. So I kept the midpoint and I'm gonna carry on right from where I left off. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty great. We're at the midpoint of this level. And we can continue pretty much as if nev there never was a split of parts. Could I? I don't think I could make it. You know, thinking about it, this level is really prone to cheese pretty much everywhere. And uh, you know how much more prone to cheese it is if I were to play with Luigi? Just imagine, Luigi would completely break this. Well, great. I'm forced to do it. I'm forced to do it with the cheating way made it so that's fine excuse me did i not land on that wow that was some bullshit right there i landed on the thing i still died though so yeah, this level is not uh well it's not easy but it's also not too bad i definitely prefer it over uh the previous one. The previous one can go die in a fire. It can just burn in hell. As far as I'm concerned, that level sucked. And I did not like it. Let's see if I can... Fuck that throw. You gotta really, uh... Nail it in well. I should just, uh... Always go for that. Okay, so here I need to actually jump over and jump onto the umbrella and do this. Yep. Okay, I don't think I want to spin grab here. Okay, this is where I died, I think. Because I fell off the donut block. Okay. Yeah, I couldn't jump off of it. This looks lovely. I don't know if it's consistently after every two. And it's not. <laughs> There's my confirmation. It's not. I can't spin jump that high. This is this is really bad. Okay, I have to kind of predict when the generator is going to get blocked by the, by the fire bar there. No. It's going to get blocked there. No. It's going to get blocked now. Yeah, okay. Oh! Oh, it's Danky Kang himself. The boy himself. Uh, do I have to fight you? I mean, it's just Mouser, so okay. I'm just gonna pump you full of bombs. Goodbye. Is this it? Oh boy, did we actually do it? We did it! Alright, on to the final level. On to the final level. We're gonna actually... Uh, I'm not gonna do any life farming, no. I'm gonna just uh, burn the 40 lives if I actually need that many. So this level... I was warned, I, I've been warned multiple times that this level is obnoxiously hard, obnoxiously long, and it only has one checkpoint. So far, what I know about that level is that it has 16 rooms. That, yeah, I've actually had that spoiled. So, uh, well, people told me. So, uh, it has 16 rooms. 
uh, each one is supposed to like represent uh, one of the 16 worlds, I guess. And then, uh, and then it has uh, like a bunch. Then, then there's the checkpoint after 16 rooms. And then there's a bunch of other bullshit. Uh, so yeah. Uh, what? Okay, that's cool. It's one of those SMW uh, platforms. Re re reskinned as mushrooms. That's pretty neat. So this is supposed to represent World One, I guess. I don't see any point in going up there. Okay, good start. Shouldn't have lowered it that much. And you know the thing is that having power-ups might actually make uh, some of these jumps harder than they are with small Mario. So I'm gonna actually stay small now. Because I think that's uh, gonna be a better idea in general. So I can just go here. Okay, we got a bunch of Goombas. Alright, this looks like room one done. Okay, we're swimming. Any jumping fish? Of course. Of course there's jumping fish. Okay, this looks... Oh my god, I didn't get the jump. That looks pretty bad. Wonder if I should drop into the water instead. Yeah, no checkpoint, so we gotta really do this all in one go. Yeah, this might take a long while. I don't actually know. Oh, great. Last pixel of the spike. I don't actually know what all of the rooms are like. Mm. But we'll see. We'll see. We'll see how bad it gets. Uh, yeah. There's only a, I think there's only a handful pe handful of people who actually beat this. I actually go from here to it's like it's the same thing essentially. And I don't know. I almost wonder if I should uh, take the water path. Or if I should just drop down here instead of trying to jump while I jump now. Wow. Thread in the needle. This jump is uncomfortable. More fish, of course. Uh, you know what? There's, there's probably invisible blocks, but SMBX just lets you enter warps in midair. Oh look, it's a flashback to my favorite level. Well, no, actually, yeah, it's a flashback to World 3-3, a level that I also really don't like. Oh, I missed the pipe, fuck. I don't think I can actually, yeah, I can't get back up like that. Okay. Okay, so far we're making steady progress, I suppose. <laughs> this is 4 out of 16 rooms. Can I make that? I'm not gonna risk it. What the fuck is that, dude? Oh, I didn't even... <sighs> fuck me. You know what? There we go. Oh wow, I didn't get the jump. Nice. There goes my power up. Gone for good. Uh, okay. Okay. Let's see then. That's probably gonna be a mushroom, right? Yeah. I don't know if I can grab it by standing here. Okay, we got it. Actually got a mushroom. Okay, let's wait a bit, because uh, it's 
It's gonna be easier to dodge that crap if I wait. Nice, look at that sink. Look at that sink up. Okay, I don't have time to lose. It's pick a pipe. It's poison mushrooms. Which pipe is the correct one? Okay, at least that's not a poison mushroom. I'm gonna, let's say middle. Okay, middle, middle it is apparently. Okay, I expect more of these, yeah. Oh wow. Fuck, I was doing pretty good actually. Until that point. Oh boy. Oh boy, this level is gonna suck. This level is actually gonna drive me insane, isn't it? Yeah, I think I, I, think I might have met uh, this might be the level that drives me nuts. Because this is room number seven. Okay, wait, it's actually, it, it would be in my interest to actually lure this. How am I gonna deal with this? Okay, we got, we got him, we got him. Got him under control. Bloopers are pretty easily manipulated. In this and the X, it's gonna shoot me. Nice, a bullet jump. No, <laughs> that was eight rooms in. Eight rooms in, no checkpoint. <sighs> now I died. Oh my god, you know what? No, 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 power up less. Fuck it. I'm gonna, uh, I'm only gonna resort to using power ups. If I really, really need to. I probably should. Because there was that one point in room number four where... I kinda didn't know what was happening with that thwomp and the platform. So I probably... There was, this was probably a... Fuck. This was probably a bad decision. But I'm gonna give it a try. You gotta at least try. But yeah, this is gonna be uh, brutal. This is gonna be very, very brutal. There's like no real way of going fast here, is there? I mean, there probably is, but it's probably risky and it might not even be consistent. Okay, room number two. Fish, fish, fish. It was that certain spot where I kind of... Fuck! I didn't get the jump again. That sucked. That spot is hard. I don't know if I can just drop onto the... I probably can just drop onto the dry bones, to be honest. And that is probably... Oh, SMBX closed. Okay, give me a second. Let me just uh, boot it back up. Because SMBX decided that it was time to close. Let's boot it back up and... Uh, might have actually lost some progress. Well, I definitely didn't lose my uh, victory over 0-3. But... Uh, yeah, but I, uh, I, I lost all my progress in 0-4. That's a thing. But I've got power-ups now and I've got some knowledge. So I can uh, deal with this. This is actually an advantage. I just, it just kind of, it's like a safe state, unintentional safe state. SMBX saves the day. Okay, this is the jump I didn't make previously, when I had the power up here. Oh, cool. Cool. It's always good when you lose a power up to a Goomba. It's just the best enemy to lose a power up to. Really shows that you know what you're doing as a... I almost wonder if I could get that shell and if that would benefit me in any way. Okay. So once you go... I didn't jump out of the water. Once you go the water path, you're committed. You can't go back.
Good to know. Well, all in all, this isn't too bad so far. It's uh, it's manageable. It's probably um, that this opinion is gonna change when I die on room number sixteen, and I have to do all of this shit again. This opinion is very likely to change at that point. But it's not that point just yet, so I can't get that Koopa. God, the fish. The onslaught of fish. I died to the dry bones. Let's just take the top path. Yeah, fuck the water. Water requires way too much... Uh, Precision jumping out of water and it's annoying. I'm not taking the water path again. I really want to go faster here. These uh, Goombas are just perfectly placed so you can't uh, go right off the bat. Just take the top path. Okay, let's just drop onto the dry bones. We're in the water now. But there's a bit more space to deal with everything here. So this is good. Oh, nice. Fish just bounced off of each other. Pretty cool. I also like this obstacle. <laughs> This obstacle with a power-up is probably, like, a pain in the dick. Oh, I almost fell. Oh, okay. That was a sharp turn. I thought I was- I thought I had time uh, for another bounce. Ah, uh, yeah. Yeah, this is gonna take a while. This is going to take a long, long while. And you know, the, the funny thing is, you know, I kind of, uh, I don't exactly understand the design choice for only having one checkpoint. Because even if this, uh, even if this was made back in 1.3 and was meant to be played only on 1.3, uh, there were ways already in 1.3 to make uh, uh, sort of pseudo checkpoints and have more than just one. Uh, it involved like, uh, well, I mean, it would kind of break the star counter in this episode. Because it involved uh, using uh, the collectible star. Because the collectible star... But that was a permanent checkpoint also. The collectible star uh, stays... I did the same thing again. Uh, the collectible star uh, die, uh, stays dead or collected permanently once you get it. So that way you could actually tie a layer uh, to... And uh, make it disappear when the star is collected and that way the layer would always be, or make it appear for that matter, and you could always have like a checkpoint. But in beta 3, which is the version I'm using to play this, it's not the most recent version of SMBX2, but it's the, the most recent version that's still uh, uh, suitable for uh, playing episodes and uh, uh, episode releases. In beta 3, you, you, multiple multipoints were already supported, so you could just uh, you could just place more than one checkpoint and have them. So I don't exactly understand what the idea behind only having one checkpoint was, but it's not a good idea. It's not a good idea because uh, you know all these rooms are probably not that bad by themselves. Like, this first room is really easy, and the second one is also not hard, the third one neither, and the, for the fourth one is kinda complicated in some parts, and I don't 
get it exactly because I only got there once. Uh, as well as all of them after that point. The sixth one kind of has those few uh, nasty jumps that look really hard. That, that where I actually took damage previously. But anyway, you know, all these rooms aren't that bad on them by themselves. I might run into a room uh, that is. I'm not saying this, but what I'm saying is that what makes this hard is just the, the fact that you have to constantly repeat everything and that there's pretty much I died in this room again and that there's pretty much no uh, no real feeling of progression you're just constantly stuck with these same rooms where if you do one mistake you're just dead and uh, yeah a checkpoint a checkpoint an additional checkpoint would not hurt it would really make this uh, better probably with all that said, I haven't seen most of it yet, so I've got, I've only gotten like what eight rooms deep. So yeah, I'll see when I get farther into the level. I'll see how much this all stands true. By that by that point, I might already hate my life, but well, that's just what it is. Right, that's just what it is. Just gotta pay attention to when these uh, grinders turn, because that's the thing that's getting me. Is when I uh, when I try and gain more momentum off of a grinder, and I just uh, end up overshooting it because it it turned. Okay, now this room, this room has that one part that I don't understand. This jump is also really uncomfortable, and I don't know if I can actually run past this or not, so I'm not even trying. This part right here, my idea previously was to do something like this, to like, yeah, I guess that's the strat. Okay. I actually have a, uh, an ice flower, so, oh wait, but then, ah, uh, I already fucked up, no wait, I can't, I can get back up, I'm curious if that's, if it's a, if it's a progressive power up, or if it's just, uh, a mushroom always, oh, that's gonna be a bitch of a jump to make, that's gonna be a bitch of a jump to make. It's a fire flower. This jump is gonna be a bitch. Okay, made it. No problem, made it. Okay, with the fire flower, I can actually kill these bastards. Well, I'm not. Okay, that one just just leave him be and go. Fuck! Should have ducked. Ah, oh, and then the low ceiling gets you. It's just these small mistakes that you just have to make to learn. And it's really punishing. Yeah, it just gets really punishing and it, yeah. And that drains the fun out of it. You know, these rooms will all be pretty fun and challenging if it wasn't for the fact that you just have to repeat everything, all, every time, always. I fell in the worst spot, probably. Okay, we still, we still saved it. We got out. Okay, don't go for that. 
it works sometimes if the if you it works if you scroll it on in a certain manner it doesn't work otherwise not not a consistent strat uh that's not but that's not good okay we're we're fine I'm just always afraid I'm gonna bonk there. And I don't know if I can actually make this or not, so I just... I assume I can't. So I just do it safe. Uh, so I'm, yeah, rather safe than sorry. So I just uh, do it like that. Okay, we're back here. We're back in this room. Lovely room of death. And let's take the ice flower. Let's freeze these bastards. Okay, let's grab the fire. Okay, almost bad. Okay. Got the fire. Now let now don't forget to duck. Don't forget to duck jump. <laughs> Every single jump. Yep. Just duck jump to win. Got an inch a bit further. Okay. Let me see if any of the other pipes actually go anywhere. Okay, so the other pipes don't even go anywhere. It's just the middle one. I'm pretty sure I can freeze these guys. Pretty sure I can. Yeah, I can, indeed. Okay, this this should make this room trivial, I hope, unless I find new and innovative ways to kill myself. Oh god. Well, So we have the uh, water room coming up next. Okay, I should take the fire flower. Damn it, just die already, fish. Okay, now this is as far as I've gotten. Room 8, bullet jump. Okay, progress. Uh, how am I gonna survive this? I'm not gonna survive that. I have no idea how you're supposed to survive this. Okay, this looks fantastic. So this is a bullet... These kinds of bullet jumps... Uh, you know what? I have a better idea. I'm just gonna do this. Yeah, honestly. That's a much better idea than what the creator wants me to do. Oh, and it's probably gonna be more bullet jumping to get into the pipe. Yep, okay. Room 9. Oh. Okay, so you can actually get soft locked there if you wait too long. That's always good to know. Of course, these troll you. Oh, I don't want to wait. I don't want to wait too long. Or else I'm gonna get soft locked yet again. Shit! No, 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 no. Nice jump scare. Okay, so this is supposed to be World B. Holy shit! No! <laughs> Why didn't I just stand still? Oh no!
Oh my god, that was ten. That was the tenth room. I was just a bit further than halfway. Oh fuck me, right? Fuck me. Yeah, fuck me. And I had power ups and all that. Imagine doing all of that shit without power ups. Well, I'm gonna have to now. I just want to go fast, dude. I don't want to wait for these goddamn Goombas to slowly move out of the way where I can kill them. I want to go fast. I just want to go, you know? Because this level just drags on. I've already been recording for half an hour and I've only put in, like, what? Ten attempts. Not even that. Not even that many. It just... It's long. It drags on for so much. For so long, it's... Oh, frustrating. It is gonna get even more frustrating, though. I don't doubt it. Okay, wait for those fish because they're very mean. Placed in a very mean way. Mean manner. Yeah, just every room has something slow paced to it. Every- ah, oh, fuck! Every room has something slow to it. Either wait for the bullets to fire, wait for the grinder to line up, line up, wait for the Goombas to get out of the way, wait for the Thwomp to fall and rise back up, wait for the Piranha Plant- oh, nice, nice corner clip. Wait for the piranha plants to move back into their pipes. Is this 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 level would really benefit from a uh, from a better flow? Because this is just waiting. You wait here, then you wait to lower this, then you wait on these goombas. Then slowly kill them and, okay, you can go. Room one done. Room two. Go and then wait on the fish so they're not in the way. You gotta align yourself with the dry bones. Wait on this bunch of fish because if you jump you die. Unless you want to thread the needle in between them. As I did on my first attempt. Which was also kind of luck. But... Whatever. And you gotta wait on the grinders till they line up so you can traverse them. There's just so much waiting. And then you can also get clipped by that one. Ugh. Come on. You just gotta really control your momentum while you're riding on these guys. And then this. Gotta wait on the thwomp. And gotta wait on this thwomp too. Okay, I'm gonna try just going. Okay, it works. You can just go. Oh. Well. Guess what my strat is gonna be now. <laughs> Since I failed to bait out the thwomp, that's the strat I use. Okay, I can get a mushroom here. If I'm smart, I can get a mushroom. It looks like it would fall directly onto this pipe. So maybe that's at least something uh, that just kind of works in your advantage spontaneously. Oh look, you, you actually don't have to wait that much here. Go figure. I was wrong all the time. Fuck! Should have just done a slightly bigger jump and I would have been fine. Uh, no, no. I want you to respond, game. I don't want you to click out of the window and 
say, yeah. Okay, up swim. Okay, bloopers never actually hit you if you're standing on the ground and if you're one block high. So as long as you either duck or uh, or are small, bloopers never hit you. How am I gonna survive this is my question. So I, n I mustn't jump on the... Oh my fucking god! I cannot jump on the dry bones there. Because as soon as I jump on the dry bones, I get, I get bopped into the spikes. Why is that spike ceiling so low? God. It's just these tiny little precision things that you always need to look out for. And as soon as you don't, you die. I honestly, it probably is possible to skip that last mushroom, to just kind of uh, jump directly into the pipe, but that would be incredibly risky. Okay, you can actually outrun, the, outrun those fish. My bad, you, do, you don't have to wait on those particular pack of fish. You can outrun them. Okay, we got the quick method. Okay. Yeah, so I'm gonna have to jump over the dry bone when I get, uh, when I get back there. Which is gonna be like sometime in the next 30 years. Just gotta remember to jump over and not jump onto. Okay, barely, but we made it. Alright, room number six. We lost power up here. Previously, always spawn that one in before you go. Yeah, you just want to do uh, shit. You just want to do one or maximum of two bounces on these. Bouncing on bullies is just always kind of weird and finicky. Okay, fish gate. No! Fucking swimming, man. B I blame swimming. I should have just gone, like, as soon as I had the opportunity. I didn't, though. Ugh. It's not even a tight fish gate. I don't, I don't need to... Lo I don't need to do a low swim ever in that room. So that's... That's something I can, uh... That's something good. Because low swimming is always kind of annoying. Well, swimming in general is pretty weird in SMBX. It has a... It is consistent, I think. But it has some weird things to it. Uh, it's just finicky in general. It's not like an SMW where... Uh, uh, your in uh, your inputs, you know, always get the same response. No, I missed the pipe. God damn it! Nope, it's not gonna work. Fuck! Nice, right into the pit. 
right into the bottomless abyss. I haven't even gotten that many attempts in this. And I'm not getting particularly far. So this is, this is the worrying thing. You know, I got, so I've gotten to the 10th room. That's as far as I've gotten. The 10th room that support, that's uh, supposed to represent world B. And in the span of those 10 rooms, there was only one power up. A single power up in room number five. Well, maybe there was one in room uh, nine. At, in the in those two question blocks at the end, I didn't bother checking those because uh, because I was gonna get soft locked in. Uh, I was gonna get trapped. Yeah. Yeah, those soft locks are also not cool because those are actual soft locks. You don't even have means of killing yourself if you fuck that up. With those uh, dropping boxes in the ninth room. Those are legitimate soft locks, as far as I could tell. Great, thanks for cooperating, Dry Bones. No, I went too soon. Fuck me. I thought I was gonna die just then. That piranha plant just barely clipped me. And I have to deal with this small. Oh. Okay, I actually made it. The key is go fast. Okay, room seven. Let's not die stupidly, because this room is actually pretty straightforward. As long as you don't do some stupid shit. Well, at least the room length is... Uh, is uh is all right yeah the room length is fine okay wait a bit now this this is the part that's like that is fucking no i didn't pay attention i didn't pay attention yeah, last time I just kind of ran through because I had iframes. Oh, I didn't even pay attention that it was Blood Bill Blaster there. Fuck. I'm probably not gonna give it too many more attempts since I'm already 45 minutes in. It's probably gonna be like a f one or two more depending on uh, how far I get. If I actually get to the checkpoint, it's gonna be a miracle. It's gonna take uh, a lot more grinding than this. No pun intended. Nice spin jump. That was a pretty nice spin jump. All right, let's give it one more attempt, and then, uh, and then we're ending video. Yeah, this is hard. If I can say one thing, I can say that this is really hard.
But I am gonna beat it. You know, I am gonna beat it. I'm not gonna give up on this. No matter what happens. Yeah, mark my words, I'm not giving up on this game. This game is going down. I almost died. That was pretty cool. Would have been a pretty eventful death. Imagine doing this without the without life farming. I don't know if I want to. Okay. That was all kind of on edge. Almost ran into the swamp for no reason. Oh, there's no need to cut these simple jumps so close. Because there's... There are numerous jumps that are way more difficult. They actually require my complete concentration and... Yeah, just, I need to be focused. Okay, kept the mushroom. That's the important thing. I'm gonna wait a bit. Because I'm afraid that would have actually clipped me. I think I'm safe. Oh! <sighs> what a bitch! Fuck! Well, I, oh wait, didn't I say that I was gonna have one more? Okay, yeah, that's the final attempt. The fucking bitch hit me exactly where I thought it wasn't gonna be. Anyways, this is hard. And this is gonna take a while. So, uh, you might expect a few more episodes of just this. Because this, yeah, this is gonna be hard. Anyways... Hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, I'll see you in the next part. And have a nice day. Goodbye.